In this video, I will show you how to fix if your Roblox is crashing in 2023. So let's jump straight into it. So as you can see, I'm here on roblox.com. Now, if you're getting an error message that looks like this, where it says an unexpected error occurred and Roblox needs to quit, then the best way to resolve this issue is to actually uninstall Roblox from your PC and go ahead and reinstall it. But what you want to do is make sure that you do uninstall Roblox properly. So in order to do this, what you're gonna to want to do is come back to your desktop and come down to the bottom left-hand corner, click on your search box, and then go ahead and type run. Underneath the best match, you should see the run app. So what you want to do is open this first and then put the following, which is a percent symbol, then app data, and another percent symbol. Go ahead and click OK. And that's going to load up a folder that's going to look like this. So from here, what you're going to want to do is first of all, come up to the top. And if you're in the roaming folder, you just want to come back onto the app data folder and then click onto local. Now from here, just click onto any of the folders and press R on your keyboard to be taken to the Roblox folder. Next, go ahead and highlight the Roblox folder and press delete to delete this folder from your system. So once you've gone ahead and deleted that, what you next want to do is come back to your desktop and again, you want to open up Run. So you can also do this by holding the Windows key and pressing R on your keyboard. And what we're gonna do now is put a percent symbol and then temp and then percent and hit enter. Again, from here, what you're gonna to want to do, if you've got a Roblox folder in here, you wanna go ahead and make sure that's deleted from here. So you can see that one's up here. So again, we're just gonna highlight it, press delete and delete this folder from our PC. And the final thing you're gonna to want to do to fully uninstall Roblox is go ahead, come back down to the search box and then go ahead and type remove programs. Underneath best match, you wanna click onto the add or remove programs app. And in here, you want to go to the search box at the top and just go ahead and type Roblox into there. So you can see we've got the player here and all you want to do is click onto this and click uninstall. And once that's done, that's going to uninstall Roblox fully from your system. So once that's all done, what you're going to want to do next is re-download Roblox. So to do that, what you want to do is open up a browser and then you want to come across to this website, which is roblox.com forward slash download. Next, go ahead and press the green download now button to start the launcher, and then you can just go ahead and run that to reinstall Roblox on your system. So if you've tried this and you're still experiencing that error, there is something else you can do. So the next thing you want to try if you've installed Roblox and it's still getting the crash error is you want to come down to the search box and you want to click onto this and type Roblox into the search. And where it says Roblox Player, what you want to do is right click onto this and then come down and click onto Open File Location. Next, go ahead and right click again onto this icon and come down and click onto Properties. What this is going to do is bring up a window like this. Now, if you look at the top, you've got some different tabs and what you want to do is click onto Compatibility and then just go ahead and tick the box which says to run this program as an administrator, which is down here. Once that's done, go ahead and click Apply and then OK. And what you want to do is restart your PC and you should be able to go ahead and open Roblox on your system. So here is a quick tutorial how to out today. And if it did, I would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video, leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.